And Flint families might soon get some of the answers that they have been waiting for. On Thursday, Governor Snyder will be going before Congress to answer questions about his handling of the Flint water crisis. But today, the focus is going to be on former emergency manager Darnell Early. Local Ford defender Kevin Dietz is in Washington, D.C. for these key hearings. In just a few hours, members of Congress will begin grilling federal, state, and city officials who were on the front lines of the decisions made in Flint. They want to know what went wrong and who's responsible. Four people will testify Tuesday. Virginia Tech water expert Mark Edwards, former Flint Mayor Dane Walling, resigned EPA Regional Director Susan Hedman, and former Flint Emergency Manager Darnell Early, who skipped his first invitation to testify before Congress. We're calling on the U.S. Marshals to hunt him down and give him that, give him that subpoena. This time, thanks to a subpoena, Darnell Early will testify. But will he answer the questions or plead the fifth so as not to incriminate himself? This was Darnell Early on the Flint water crisis prior to the subpoena. The one thing that I will say is that you know people should examine the facts before they rush to, you know, to judgment and before they uh, say what is actually factual and is not. Early going on record saying it was not a state appointed emergency manager that made the decision to switch from Detroit Water to the Karagandi Water Authority. I think when people, uh, when people examine those facts, they'll see that that decision was made not by emergency managers but by the local unit of government and uh, that th it was not something that was forced on them. But that has proven to be wrong. The decision was made by emergency manager Ed Kurtz and approved by a city council that had no authority to act. Darnell Early was the emergency manager in charge when the decision to use the Flint water as a water source was made and when an official at the Flint plant warned staff was not ready for the switch. When residents complained about brown nasty water that might be dangerous, Darnell Early did not recommend switching back to the Detroit system. Congress will want to know why. The hearings begin at 10 a.m. and the defenders will be there to bring it all to you along with reactions. Several people from Flint have made the trip to hear the hearings and we'll have the reaction for you too later on Local 4 News. Kevin Dietz, Defenders.